Welcome to another episode of Cube Corner Live. Oh shoot. Can Showtime. you believe it? It's another episode of Q Corner Showtime Live. On this episode of Q Corner, we're going to be sharing three top twisting tips from the wonderful Jackie O. I am looking forward to them, absolutely. Uh, we've also got a quick custom colour class with Sue Baller as well. We're going to be answering some of the questions that you guys have been posting on our YouTube clips. You asked, we listened. And we've also got a fantastic organic number design as well by Alexander and Sue. But before that, we should definitely do this. We should. So, what has been happening with you, Don? Oh, I've had an awesome week. I've been to Rotherham. I've been doing a fundamentals course there. Mm -hmm. Always an enjoyable day. And what are you doing? Because <laughs> <laughs> I've got what day are you doing? Well, I'm getting ready to head off to Dubai soonish for the Paper World Trade Show. I'm hoping to uh, see some of you guys so you can be there and take part in the balloon competitions that I'm going to be hosting each day. That's pretty cool, yes. Um, anyway, for more details on that, you can always join the Qualitex Middle East Facebook group. Now, if you haven't already joined, make sure you join now. Why haven't you joined? Exactly. Because it's going to be a whole lot of fun and I'm going to be there on the Gravitas stand for any questions that you may have or any questions about product techniques whatever you have any issues yeah. come and see me have a chat if you just want to chat that's okay too that's gonna to be a pretty cool week I it think is. yes so how have, how's your week been how are you guys you can tell us jump on the chat we don't mind we're here all the time we answer where um, we can I hope you have your um, your Ooh. nice cup of tea I have mine De -de -de. now Guys, we know that you're all here to see some of the Jackie stuff. No, it's me who come to see. No, no, we know, we know that you come to see some Jackie stuff. She was wonderful to us. She was uh, uh, very generous in sharing some of her top tips. But we have the stuff that you didn't know, which Ooh, I'm sure trying to remember what it is that you don't know, as I might not know. You know that we did at the beginning, where you put it up and went, "It's like this," and it's Sue's custom colour class. And Alexander's... Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah remember That's all that. Right. Oh, yes. You know, we did this, we did this, we did this. We, we did do this. So, um, we're, we're going to do that first before we get on to the Jackie stuff. So, hello, guys. Yeah. We've got California, we've got wait. Chicago, we've got, we've got people from all Chicago. over the place. Hello, and we've got Jackie as well. Jackie's turned up. Hiya, Jackie. We Jackie, saw her. Oh. We knew you'd be here. There we, We've got some info about where Jackie's going to be, and apparently it's everywhere. Yes. Yeah, pretty I mean, much everywhere. It does help that we put that GPS device on us so we know exactly where she is. It's that it's little bracelet place. thing that she has on the on her ankle. Yeah, the tracking <laughs> bracelet. Yeah, it's handy. That's Look at that. Tasmania and Canada. 5 a.m. Wow, that's early. It's thank truly international. Thank you, thank you. I'd like so, to think you got up especially for us, or is it that you were up anywhere? Up, they were up for us specially. From Good. Tasmania. Good to know. Exactly. So um, I think what we'll do first of all is we shall <laughs> we shall share what about Sue's custom colour class. Yes. I love a bit of custom colour. Now really? for those of you that didn't know, there's another channel out there as well, but it's for the Russian speaking audience and there was some great information shared on there. Um, yes. But we thought we would share it with you guys uh, in English as well. So it's you're going to enjoy it. Yes. So let's leave you with that. Let's watch Sue's class. We will. 
Hi everybody, my name is Sue Bowler and I would just like to talk to you quickly about custom colouring balloons. It's a technique that I love to use in my designs all the time. This is the perfect time of year to be custom colouring because spring is here, the sun is shining and uh, one of the biggest trends at the moment is pastel tones. So I'm going to just show you quickly how to create a beautiful palette of pastel tones. So we're going to use 5 inch white for the outside. I'm going to use a wooden stick, a chopstick, which is perfect. And I'm just going to slide the pink inside the white balloon. And you'll see that it slides in very, very easily. I'm just going to take my hand pump and just put a couple of pumps in. And you can see that we have a beautiful, very, very pale shade of pink now. I'm going to tie that one off. Um, I'm going to just quickly show you a few more colours. This one is using pale blue. Slide that one inside a pearl, uh, sorry, a white. And then we have a beautiful, very pastel shade of blue. So you can see that this would be perfect for baby designs, weddings, Easter, Woman's Day, Mother's Day, and much, much more. Um, another one of my absolute favorites is yellow inside white. So we can do this, it's nice and quick and easy. It just allows us to create a whole new palette of colors. And here's one that I've already prepared, so I'll quickly show you um, how they look. So the white is in the center, so you can see how they vary to the white. Then we have spring lilac, which is beautiful. Caribbean blue, which I absolutely love. The yellow, the pale blue, and the pink. So I'll look forward to seeing your wonderful designs. Thanks for that, Sue. Yeah, that was great. And if you want some uh, info on Sue, where you might see her. Well, she will be at the German Balloon Convention, which is the 29th to the 31st of March, 2019. She's also going to be doing a Simply Organics course in Canada. And not to forget to mention that, that she was in the very best of 2018 as an influencer of 2018. 2018. I'm struggling with that 2018 because I've tried to reprogram myself to say it's 2019. But it's not. It was for the influencer in 2018. If you haven't read that very best of 2018 book, <laughs> why not? It's fantastic. Everybody that's been reading it, the feedback has been immense. However, Get yourself a copy. But you can also catch Sue on the Very Best Balloon Blog, of course. If you don't know what that is, just go on Google, do a search for the Very Best Balloon Blog. You'll find it. It's an absolute gold mine of information out there. It is. I was just about to say, though, for the um, Very Best of 2018, we have had a lot of questions about where you can buy that. I think we should, it's time that we should answer a few of those questions while you're I ready. agree. We'll do that one. Yeah. So, the how do you do the 2018? People have been asking, how do we do it? So it's very easy. We're gonna help you. So let's just uh, can you kind of zoom us into kind of little areas. Let's separate this. There we go. Look at we're that. We're there. We're there. We're there. We're there. And of course, so let me grab this as well. As we would on. normally say, where would you find that information? Well, you can't go wrong with Qualitex.com. And that's where you go, as per usual. You can go on there and go on all your local areas. You'll find the links, no problem. And you can. we're using the US site for this uh, demonstration. But again, if you go on your own version, whether it be Brazil, Europe, whatever, it's the same. It is. All you need to do is navigate to the top. We have the menu there, and it has events at the top there. We have, um, not events, sorry. That's something else. It's magazines. Magazines, Dom. Magazines. Magazines. So you're going to go to yourself your magazines, there and then the magazines, we you can have... see, just slightly hidden underneath here by me. Up. Oh, there we go. It's gone up there as well. It says um, balloon images, and yep. it's got view the latest issue. So obviously, this is where we get balloon images anyway. Yay. If you haven't seen balloon images again. Oh, my goodness. Why not? It's why, awesome. why not? Balloon images online. It's, com it's a complete game changer now. It so is. get yourself on there. So we can see that issue one hiding behind Keith. Sorry, you can't move that. It does say 2019 issue one yes um if you just click on it i have here we go look, look at this at that. i love uh, that graphic it's, isn't it a fantastic graphic i do i mean i like the astronaut anyway but that little video i like i'm going to use a joke from last time i'm over the moon with that i think it's out of this world 
quick joke. <laughs> what do you do if you see a spaceman? Park the car, man. Come on! Need better material. Come than that. on! At least we got Jackie on the show this this week. Otherwise, <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Uber. Thanks. Oh, okay. I know. Anyway, moving on. So anyway, if you want to get this very best of 2018, see, it just rolls off the tongue now. <laughs> totally there. Uh, in this issue, there is a link there for the very best of 2018. Select that, and it will open you up into this page here, showing you a preview, and it gives you a link there to purchase your copy today. Select that, and it'll take you to the lulu.com website. And on there... Because we're in Europe, we have to confirm yes. that we... Uh, no, no, please help me out. We'll just close, just close it. it. We don't need to yeah. do that right now. But it gives you the it's link. cookies, we're in Europe. Yay! It'll show in your local regional currency. Uh, we're in the UK, so we've got it in pounds. Um, and you just follow the link and instructions on that page there, and it will magically appear in your letterbox. How cool is that? I know! Everybody, I was dead. everybody loves awesome. it. It is it is truly awesome. Right, okay, yes. let's go back to <laughs> maximize. We're back, we're there back, we go, back. we're back normal size. Bye. So that's a question answered. But we've now figured out what our colours we can use with M. Um, Sue's taught us about custom colours. If you want to know any more information yes. about custom colours, we did a special episode on we it did. a little while ago with Zoe. Yes. Um, and it's she did excellent. a special on custom colours. Have a little look on the bus. I love custom colours, but I, I, I often need that little bit of inspiration and that little push of going, use this one and not that one. Love it. Yeah. Okay. Love it, love it, love it. Absolutely. So um, what we'll do is we'll have a little look at what Alexander did with that information. Yes, let me go and find that for you. Oh, I know where it is. Here we go. Are we ready? Enjoy.
excellent work, Alexander. I think that was absolutely beautiful, yeah. Daffy's just said it right there. Absolutely beautiful piece of work. Yeah. Um, so thank you very much for sharing that, Alexander. Nice to see from the framing, from you know, from the ground up as well, because I yeah. know a lot of people have uh, the issues with framing and what to use, where to get it from. But there was nothing complicated there. It was all bits that you could buy from a local hardware store. It's simple as well. The aluminium that was used on that was eight millimeter. Um, if you want to know, and also, um, okay. subscriber. The, it was 8mm um, aluminium rod, the bottom circle was 55cm um, cool. in diameter and the top circle was 45cm which makes a 1m high letter and I think that was, uh, was really stunning. Number. Makes a number. <laughs> Same thing. I hate you dog. <laughs> oh, there, there we go. It's like yeah. a joke but Gorgeous for the colours. Yes, absolutely. But obviously you don't have to do custom colours, you can do that with all the colours in the uh, Qualitex portfolio of colours. But that custom colour is... It's bang on trend, isn't it? It is totally. Bang on trend. Pinterest worthy, absolutely. Yes, absolutely. So, um, that was... That was Alexander. So and that was done for the Qualitex TV, the, uh, the yeah. Russian Keith and Dom. <laughs> if you watch it, if you watch it, if you're fluent in Russian, I totally um, am. You not. watch it. If not, you can catch it anywhere. There's some great bits on there that you can get the ideas from. Yes. So uh, that's really cool. We're cool. gonna ask some balloons. balloons. We're gonna answer some more questions. Yeah. So you guys have been asking some questions you on have. our Facebook videos. So we thought instead of just answering them straight there, we're gonna start on taking Facebook some videos. of them. Sorry. On our Facebook videos. YouTube videos. Sorry. YouTube videos. He knows what I mean. Instead of going back and just typing them on there, we thought we would start dragging them into the show yeah, and answering in. them on here. Yes, yeah, so here's our first one. Our first what question. What have we got? What's the question? The question is, can't read it. Oh yeah, it was, what is the brand? I remember this one. <laughs> what are the brand? You guys can see this better than we can. <laughs> I've got it. Yeah. It says... What are the brand of the LED, the puck lights that we used in that video, which is how to do perfect LED lights, the light of balloons? Well, the thing is, is that we um, will show you. Here we go. This is the particular one that we have um, because it's very... E Another subscriber. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah, um, it's very easy for us to get because it's from a store in the UK called B&M's. It's like a bargain discount store. Uh, it's actually manufactured uh, for them, so this is kind of their own branded. It's three pounds ninety nine, so very inexpensive, and it is a waterproof, multicolored RGB LED with a remote control as well. Um, you don't get the batteries with it, but you do get the unit and the remote. Yeah, that's just it's cool because it's waterproof, isn't it? It is. Yeah, it's just. Yeah. And then what we do is we use that, like you saw, saw on the other video, we put a piece of stretchy balloon tape on the back and tie some nylon line so we can pull it into the balloon and it sits perfectly at the bottom. But there are loads of versions of this out there and yep. they probably all come from the same manufacturer, just rebranded. I do know there's some on eBay, Amazon and other sites like that. Yeah. There's, there's a lot. Um, but We just like to try and buy in the high street wherever possible. Absolutely. So there we go. So that's cool. But so that was a question. question. Thank you for the question. Yeah. Answered. Yay. Next question, Dom. Dick. Our next one is question number two. Um, and that is about, is that the sandwich? Measurements. We had the Creating video. perfect sandwich. That's it. Yep. How do I make perfect sandwiches? That's right. We do them very well. And the question was, I have to grab the bits. It was the weight oh, measurements of. Be right back. See, I, I get it all ready for him. I know, I know, I know. Here we go, right. So it was the weight measurements. Yeah. Um, How long the weight? Yes, because we showed the bottle on the video, um, but the bottle was too small for you to see what weight mm. measurements they are. But they are, um, it's 100 grams, it's 180 grams, and it's 200 grams of sand. So what you need How is... How did we know how many grams we needed, though? Well, in the Qualitex catalogue, which you can get, if you don't have the hard copy, you can go to, there's a website. I wonder what that website's called. What's that website? Hmm. Is it qualitex.com? Well, you can't go wrong with qualitex.com. Right. I think I can see a t-shirt coming with that. I can, I can. Okay. But on that catalog or in that catalog, there is a chart, all the balloons that Qualitex makes, which is great. You've got float times and you've got Heating gas capacity. capacity. And you've also got the lift. The lift capacity. So it means ah. that we know exactly how much it takes 
to hold it down. To hold it down. So and then we what we do is we always add extra on. Yes. But we make set weights. But so. we pretty much know for a bouquet what we want to put in there, or perhaps a, a bigger design, a three foot design. So we're, we're hitting for a weight that we know is going to hold it down and keep it in place. So we use a small set of digital scales okay. and a bottle and a funnel and some sand and we get the if we are asking one of our members of staff to make sand weights for us we have them all of set sizes and it's dead easy for us i noticed you were doing very well without holding that straight so you didn't drop that all over and there we go See, professional yes. another thank you very much guys we really appreciate it we're going to hit four thousand very shortly we're 4, very 000. much looking forward to seeing this if it actually goes to four yeah, it'll be nice if we have yet. Hang on. It'll be, once we get to 4,000, so we we're need another, to do something special. Ooh, 38 people out there in YouTube land. So if you're watching now and you haven't subscribed... Yeah, because over 66% of our viewers are non-subscribers. We know this for a fact. That's you now watching. But, yes, if it's you, you and you're not look, subscribed, do it. Down here. Hit it. Hit the subscribe. Then hit the bell. Get the bell on. you'll know there all the go. extra super duper bonus videos. Because we have been releasing a couple without announcing. <laughs> yeah, sneaky ones, we know. But that was question two. We it have was. one more question. Number we do. Three. This week, one more question. Somebody asked about the design on the Spring Fair stand, again, on one of our videos. It was about the um, the dinosaur. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Let's throw that up so people can see what we're talking about. It was this one here. Yeah, it was a dinosaur scene with the volcano. And yeah. the question was about... Um, the should give it. We should give up. Well, one second. Uh, somebody's put a thing there, and I can sh show it. We should give a prize for the four thousandth subscriber. You know what, Julie? You're right. You're right. If, yes, thank uh, you, Julie. My partner in crime for my fundamentals course this week. I couldn't have done it without you. Thank you. Yeah, we shall give a prize for the four thousandth subscriber. Yeah, it might not be a good prize, but it'll definitely be a prize. A nice big warm hug. Yep. We have. Um, a slightly deflated lime green 260Q balloon dog at the corner of the Can't think why. studio. Can't think um, why. But anyway, go we'll back to this that. question. We'll work on that. The volcano. Yes. The question was about the main structure. Was it alternate square pack um, that made the main volcano? Yes. The answer is yes, it was alternate square pack. And the other answer, well, the other question in the same question was... Easy for you to say. Yeah. The other part well, of the same question... <laughs> Second part of the same question was, um, who was the designer? Now, the designer was Alberto Falcone. Yes. He so, done, had done some excellent designs for yep. uh, this year's Spring so, Fair. That was pretty cool. That we answered the questions. Yes, we did. Well, three for three there. So, is there anything left to say on the show? Uh, no, I think I think that's prob probably... Are we I done? Think, I'll just check on our list here. No, I can't seem to... Oh, oh, there, were, oh, oh there was something to do with a twisting tip or, or something. Twi like. Three twisting tips from Jackie O. Oh, that's right. Have we got that footage done? Can we roll that footage? Okay. I suppose. Is that what we've been waiting for? We've, that's the only reason of, these people are here. We've kind of been waiting for that. Okay. Uh, let's have a look. Let's see if I can... Oh, I don't seem to have the... F uh, I've got some outtake footage. Outtake footage of Jackie? No. Is that it? I don't think we're out to run that. Oh, no, here. I've got the proper video. Okay. <sighs> here it is. Enjoy. Right. Enjoy. We did. Hi, it's Jackie O from Airdrie, Alberta, Canada. So Dom and Keith asked me to uh, put together a little video for everybody to show them um, just some little tips and tricks that I use in my job every day. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is how to curl a balloon. And I use this all the time. Um, if you look at any of my centerpieces, you will see these little curls everywhere, especially in my unicorn centerpiece. So I'm just gonna show you how I do it. So the first thing I'm going to do is to pre-inflate the balloon. So you wanna inflate it all the way and then let the air out. And then what I do is grab my 160 pump and I'm going to use this little ridge part here just to hold the balloon on with my thumb. And then I'm gonna wrap it around, keeping it flat the entire time. And I'm gonna use my Legenda pump. This, you, um, this works with the floor pump as well. And then just inflate it. And I'm gonna let out a little bit of air and that is going to really tighten the curl. And then you just 
tie it off. And the good thing about using the 160 pump is that your curl is going to be uniform every single time. It's going to look exactly the same. Okay, so that's my first trick. The second one I want to show you, speaking of unicorns, is how to twist a unicorn's horn. So I'm just going to inflate about as much as I need. Tie it off. And I love the chrome gold balloons for this unicorn horn. I'm going to fold the balloon in half. And then with my thumbs, I am rotating the balloons to my left while twisting them together to my right. And this is gonna hold them together really tightly and make for a really pretty horn. So I'm gonna just show you what that looks like. So I'm rotating to the left while crossing them over to the right. When I get to the top, I am just going to twist that off, cut off my tip, and then just tie that together. like that. It does take some practice to get it quite tight. Um, this also works for Christmas time if you're making candy canes with a red and white balloon. And the last thing I want to show you is a simple braid and I used this for the last mermaid I made. Um, I actually used it for her tail. So what I did is I made uh, just some cute little tail fins with a chrome blue and a chrome green 260. Just a couple pinch twists there some bubbles. You can do this tail fin any way you like. Make it a little bit more elaborate or less. Then I blew up four 260s, two in the chrome blue and two in the chrome green. And I'm just going to feed it through those pinch twists on my tail fins. Okay, so you got two going through that way. I'm going to send the other two through. Now we have four balloons coming out of that fin area and I'm going to lay them flat and then I'm just going to do uh, a simple four strand braid. This works on hair too for you moms and dads out there with girls with long hair. So I'm just crossing over just like you're doing a simple three braid but this one is going to go under. Okay. you do this the better you're going to get at it. I just want to show you what it looks like at the end. It's just a really nice way to get a flat kind of elaborate looking tail that takes as you can see like zero time at all. You are going to have to straighten it out and you can just see how pretty that looks. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed my tips and tricks. Now back to Cute Corner Boys. Wow. <laughs> Pretty awesome, that. Can we get a thumbs up, guys? Can we get a heart? Put a heart in the chat if you liked it. We'd really appreciate it. Thank Wolf you there. so Thank much, you. Jackie. Really yeah. appreciate that. Stick some hearts. We want to say something yeah. there. We want to say Not a just huge... from you, Jackie, though. That's like kind of, you know... Yeah, we just we do want to say a huge thank you to Jackie who took time out on that to uh, make those videos and thank share you. with the top tips. Uh, the unicorn horn with the chrome, that tightness of that horn. I mean, we normally do this the swirl, mm. but it's kind of like a swirl through the fingers and it's it's much looser. Yeah. That one, how she does that, it's brilliant. Okay, it really it's is next level stuff. Super nice. It's always those little bits that just improve your work that just takes it to that next level. Somewhere closer to the level of Jackie. Exactly. So, um, if you would like to see Jackie oh, this yeah. year, you could meet her at the German Balloon Convention in, Europe. in March. Or if you want to go further afield, you've also got Balloon Camp in Australia, 21st to the 23rd of July. She's going to be working alongside Dominic and Beirut in October. 
and she was also featured uh, as an influencer of 2018 in the very best of 2018. And there was an incredible article written by Sue mm. on Jackie in the very best balloon blog. So if you want to learn a little bit more about her, yep. go back in there and have a good old read on that blog. So exactly. It, again, you know, it is something that comes out. It's got fresh news in there, but there's great articles that you can refer back to because that's from, I think, September last year. Yep. But it's great. Loads of information, bits and pieces about Jackie, which is awesome read. And there's loads of other stuff as well. Why well, you're Look there. at that. The chat's just blown up. Thank Yay! you very much, guys. We really appreciate it. We would yes. also appreciate as well is that later on, if you come back and look at this video, drop a like on it there. Yeah. Because it really helps us. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Please. Hit the bell. Because we're going to be releasing a few more more videos coming yeah, out we've been working Secretly. hard yes d d d our ninja videos our ninja videos next episode you're not going to want to miss that no this is a special this yes. is if you've ever thought about ever wanted to do you weren't quite sure cba exam to become a certified balloon artist if you've and ever thought about it not just us we've roped in the talents the cba queen the one and only Sue Baller. Yes. And we're going to be doing a very special episode all about it next. Thank you very much. Yes. Um, we're going to do a very special episode in two weeks' time. So we will see you there. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for everybody that contributed. Thanks for Alexander. Thanks to Sue. Yes. And thank you very much to Jackie. Yes. So see you on the next episode. Thank Bye you very for now. much. Wow.